To do an eccentric slider leg curl, you're kind of skipping the concentric portion where you're pulling the legs in. Like normally with a slider leg curl, you'd keep the, leg, the hips up and pull the feet in. Instead, we're just focusing on the lowering portion. And usually with this type of exercise, we'll focus on going really slowly on that extension of the legs. So it looks like this. You'll start with heels in. You'll bridge up and just quick tip, when you put your heels on the sliders, your best bet is to put your heel in the middle of the slider, not near the back or off to the front because you're more than likely gonna slide off either direction at some point. So heel right in the middle of the slider, that's where you wanna keep your weight anyway. You'll bridge the hips up and then we're controlling this descent. So you need to keep your glutes squeezed, keep your abs tight. That way you're um, keeping your hips elevated and slowly lower those legs or extend those legs as the hips drop. So maybe thinking like three to four, maybe even five seconds if you're really trying to push it. And then once you get to that extended position, you'll just pull the feet back in. So lift the hips slowly over three or four seconds, extend those legs out. You'll really feel it toward the end range of motion. And then while your hips are down, pull the heels in, bridge the hips up, and just repeat that pattern for all your repetitions. Remember the slower you go, the harder it's gonna be.